a smaller load. <sighs> okay, so it's smaller than a half. It's smaller than a half, but it's bigger than a 7 sixteenths. That doesn't make any sense unless it's metric. Yeah, oh, metric I think. Crap. That was seven. Okay. Seven six. Okay, so I'm currently taking off the fan and there's four bolts on this fan. Okay, so I've taken off the fan, but I've run across one small issue here, and that is that didn't take off. So now I've got to figure out how this thing comes off. Alright, so taking off the fan didn't actually take off what I needed to come off, so... What I think's got to come off is the... this bracket here, which will then the whole assembly will come off. Okay, so that's what I need to go back to what I originally was going to do, was going to take off this... Um, It's the, it looks like a balancer that, that attaches to the fan. So, what I've got to do, so, I've taken off the shroud. Anyway, so I'm, I took off the fan, but that didn't seem to do what I needed it to do. Taking off the, I've got to take off the whole fan assembly. I've got to take off the whole fan assembly here because uh, that's the only way I can get this thing off. So, and that's a 760. So, I'm gonna put one of these bolts back because this thing's flopping around like crazy. I went ahead and reattached the, uh, with one bolt, the fan back into the balancer. I guess that's what that is. Um, just so I can not have to worry about the thing flopping around as I'm doing this. Anyway, 7 sixteenths. Uh, damn it. Missing a bolt. Oh boy. Missing a bolt. Give any idea. Oh, let me put this back on. Okay. All right. I'm going to be taking off the belt now, uh, just to give me a little easier access to without everything under tension. Um, this is a breakover bar. This is absolutely, absolutely critical when you're using when you're working on anything that's been seized bolt wise, and you just need the leverage. This is where it's make your job so much easier, the fact that this is so long. This is going to give you plenty of leverage. This is the same idea with this, why I attach, why I attach this, uh, this monkey crescent wrench, excuse me, uh, why I gave it, why I put the bar on here to give it more leverage. And this is the same idea. You just got, this is a breakover bar, those stubborn bolts, and it just makes it, your job so much easier. It just takes very little effort to give it 
to get the bolts loose or move something that's very wound out tight. So just move this up, hold it, and the, the belt will come off. And you can slide the belt off. Get the belt off. We're going to check this later for any cracks. And if I see any, I'm going to check this later for any cracks. So. I know I just figured out what it's attached to. The fan is attached to the water pump. So that's what we're, that's what I'm detaching uh, from the actual water pump. Gotten uh, the shroud off. I, I've done some extra steps. I probably didn't need to do. Once I got the the fan detached from the from this balancer, looks like a balancer. Um, I should have just pushed back the the fan blade, and then that would give me room enough to get this off. Because that's what was hitting. It was hitting. I'm just gonna take that take that off and. thing I'm trying to figure out is how to get this off. Right, I guess that's how you get that off. Damn. Okay, so just a little bit of work. Comes right off though. No big deal. Okay. So this this was fitting like this. And I had taken off this. Um, that's all I really needed to unloosen these bolts, and that would have got the shroud off. But I'm going to still have to get that water pump off, so I needed to do this to begin with. So we got all this off. 
So this fit like this. And to get that shroud off, all I needed to do was remove the bolts that it was holding out, holding the fan onto this part, which looks like a balancer. So all I need, really needed to do was um, take off this, and then I could add enough room to, to get the shroud past the fan blades there. But this all had to come off, so it, it didn't really matter at this point. But there you go. So now, I've just got a, okay, I'm hoping, okay, it looks like everything's open now. Looks like, every, looks like the engine you see on television now. 